Life under microscope. Morphological changes in erythrocytes. In this video we will talk about the morphological changes in erythrocytes, such as acanthocytes, echinocytes, elliptocyte, spherocyte, stomatocyte, schistocytes, tear drop cell, sickle cell. Acanthocytes. Cells are spheroidal and lack central pallor, with a variate size of tags, located irregular, on the cell surface. This condition is caused by anorexia nervosa, malnutrition, post-splenectomy, end-stage liver disease, hereditary acanthocytosis, hereditary abetaloproteinemi. Echinocytes are normochromic, with normal color. The blunt short tags are evenly distributed on the cell surface. This condition is caused by pyruvate kinase, deficiency, liver disease, renal disease. High humidity makes the smear dry slowly. Teardrop cells, decorocytes, shape of a pear or teardrop. The end of the cell varies in shape and length. It can be short or long, rounded or blunted. This condition is seen in osteoporosis, iron deficiency, anemia, pernicious anemia, anemia of renal disease, myelofibrosis, bone marrow infiltrated with hematological or non-hematological malignancies. Sickle cells occur as a result of a defect in hemoglobin. The amino acid valine is exchanged for glutamic acid, which gives rise to a defective hemoglobin S. This is seen in sickle cell anemia, hemoglobin SC, S-beta thalassemia, hemoglobin SD. Target cells are characterized by the hemoglobin is being centrally located in the cell and surrounded by pallor. This morphological change gives it a shape of bullseye or sombrero. These cells are usually larger than normal erythrocytes due to excess cell membranes. This is seen in hemoglobin C, sickle cell disease, hemoglobin E, hemoglobin H disease, thalassemia, iron deficiency anemia, liver disease. Target cells are seen with most of the hemoglobinopathies. Stomatocytes shapes erythrocytes have a clear opening located centrally in the cell with a shape of a mouth. This condition is seen in hereditary stomatocytosis, liver disease, obstructive lung disease. It can also be an artifact due to high humidity which makes the smear dry slowly. Elliptocytovalocytes these terms are interchangeable. The cell are elongated with blunt ends and parallel sides. These changes are seen in renal and liver diseases, vitamin B12 deficiency, myelodysplasia. If microscopic examination shows more than 25%, then it's called hereditary elliptocytosis. Spherocytes have a spherical shape. The MCV is normal to reduced. These cells have no central pallor. This is seen in hereditary spherocytosis, a bioincompatibility, autoimmune hemolytic anemia, warm antibody type, infections for example EBV, CMV, E. coli, sepsis or urosepsis, severe burns, dick and hoos, post-transfusion. Hemolytic cells, microangiopathic process leads to cell injury. When fibrin strands are generated, it leads to cell injury. Hemolytic uremic, syndrome whose thrombotic thrombocytopenic, purpura TTP, disseminated intravascular, coagulation dick, other microangiopathic hemolytic, anemia, 